Hi, my name is Abigail Rumer. I'm an athletic trainer for Franciscan Health Sports Medicine, and I've been an athletic trainer for five years. And I love being an athletic trainer because obviously I love sports, but being around the athletes and helping them more on a medical standpoint, it's pretty fun and rewarding to see them get back to sports. It's really important to hydrate. My, I tell my kids this all the time. They don't really believe it, but they really need to make sure that they are drinking a lot of water just to help with eliminating cramping, eliminating, you know, um, getting sick just because of the heat, as well as making their bodies feel better because when they're drinking water, they feel like they can actually compete and they have the energy to do so. I always tell my kids that hydration is important before practice or before games, but also during games, um, as well as after, just because of how much they're gonna be working, they need to make sure that they are fueling up and having enough energy. So I'm a big believer in, obviously, water is gonna be the best for the kids just because of um, with how much salt they're losing by sweating so much on a Friday night game, having enough to kind of replenish that is very important with the athletes. Um, so I really am a big believer in water. I tell my kids that they should be filling up their water bottle at least three to four times a day just to make sure that they're prepared for the game. Um, I do also like Powerade and Gatorade as well, just because of kind of helps with the electrolytes and gives them a little bit of like some fuel just to be able to compete and push to the end of their game. So one good thing I bring up to my athletes is I tell them to watch the color of their urine um, just because the darker it is, the more dehydrated they are. Um, that's when kidneys can start to fail. That's when the muscles are breaking down because they're not having enough um, adequate water intake. So I always tell them on the spectrum, you wanna make sure that it's a lighter color yellow rather than a darker color yellow. A lot of the times we're looking at cramping, we're looking at you know sweating profusely, or even when they stop sweating, that can be kind of a big indicator that they are dehydrated. Um, a lot of my kids get headaches. That's a big sign of have they had enough water today. Um, but being an athletic trainer, we're prepared for those because of how we practice and with our emergency action plans. So dehydration is definitely on our list of watching, but when they hydrate enough, it's okay. For more information, visit franciscanhealth.org slash sportsmedicine.